What's up, y'all? Welcome back to the New York Tech Dragons. And today we're taking on Mid Tennessee, Mid, Mid, Mid Tennessee State for our second to last game of the regular season. Joseph Robinson coming into the game, having a decent season, actually. 31 touchdowns, only nine interceptions. Defense has played well. We're 9 and 1 coming off a uh, heartbreaking loss to FIU, who was ranked and ranked even higher than we were. And we're already on second down and eight. Let's not get the third down and long. Ironically, this is the best team ratings wise that we faced all year. And we are already to third down. Look at Acevedo coming across the fields. I actually want you a more of a slant instead of a. Yeah, there you go. See, he's not going to be open. Yes, he is. Just get it out there. Oh, no, it's a missed throw. And we have to punt already. Throw down coming. We need to stop. Gordon Miller, make that play. He's picked it off. Let's go. Go run. Run. We might have a pick six here if number 84 doesn't catch us. Stovall's going to stay in bounds. And he's going to score. Sidney Stovall, the 62-yard pick six to give us the lead. That's not his first pick six of the season. He's done that. It's probably at least his second, if not his third on the season. And yeah, if our offense doesn't do well, we need the defense to make plays like that. Tennessee is threatening. Run. We need a big stop. We get the tackle. I think he lost two yards there. I am down with that. We got a big play here, though. Third and five. I'm going to guess pass. Oh, I'm glad I did. Oh, God. I can only cover so many people, and they're going to tie it up. Salam is back. He missed pretty much the entire game last week, which did hurt our running game. And look at the blocking. Granted, there's only three, only three rushers. It didn't matter. It still got to us. Granted, we had nobody open. I'm um, looking at Peaks here on the outside. Peaks has speed. I'm going to let him go get it. I'm going to let him. It's going to be underthrown. He still makes the catch. What a play. Did not think that was going to happen. Thought he was going to drop it or get knocked away. But Peaks able to go up and get the ball. I wish we got a replay on that one. You know what? I'll give it to you. The throw just over the the arms. Got like slow. No, no slow down. Uh, whatever. He just makes up crazy ground. I mean, just goes up just over the outstretched arms of the corner. We have the lead. So we, we don't have the lead. I don't know what I was thinking. I wasn't thinking that was the problem. Get that first down, Joseph. We got the first down is what I what I meant to say. And we got one there. Now that, I'm going to keep trying to run the ball. I'm only getting like two to three yards a carry. Uh, Mid-Tennessee, their, their ratings are this pretty good. And goodness gracious. No chance. I'm going to try a screen pass. See if that... J just barely get it off. Yep, spin move. Stiff arm. Finally, Salam gets something. Granted, that was a... Oh, I'm going to switch to a run here. The screen pass. Let's get... The, who, who is... Number 99. Try to juke around and give me that first down. Let's go. Uh, maybe Wiggins here. I'm going to step up in the pocket. Look at the space. And the speed by Joseph Robinson. Oh, little juke move to the outside. Didn't really juke. Just kind of cut to the outside. Joseph Robinson showing off his wheels. He does have 87 speed. So he can definitely run. Showing it there. And now I can say it. We have the lead. And guess what? We got another pick. Is it going to be another pick six? No. But we are in mid-Tennessee territory. Almost instantly. Hunter Haynes with the interception. Just what we needed. Just what the doctor ordered. Defense has not been... Take this to Angel. Get this to Angel. What a catch. We are seeing... Our team makes some ridiculous catches. And that was one of a diving catch fingertips. I don't know how he got that, but we gotta just got to keep... Uh, Keep going here. Let's see. A little slants. Maybe Wiggins. Nope. It's going to be Robinson taking it in again. And that is such a late hit. Where is the penalty? We're going to double our lead. And we're going to go up 21-7. to seven. So shout out to the defense. Turnover. We turn it into points. Third and 11. I'm going to guess pass. I'm assuming they're not going to run here. 
and wide open down the seam. And that's a first down. I don't like this. They're attacking. They might score. I mean, ratings wise, this is probably the best team we faced all year. Oh, here, up the middle. We're there. Ooh. I smell it. Do you smell it? It's a stop. I'm trying to make all my changes here. Pinch the line. Yep. Yep. Oh, I see. Oh, he's got throw it away. I thought he was throwing to the guy there. He might have had him, to be honest. But guess what? We made the stop. No touchdown. That is the definition of bend, don't break defense. No, no penalties, please. There we go. And he missed the field goal. Let's go. I'm keeping that entire series in. That was huge. What a play. What a play by the defense. Doing what they needed to do. Look at this. To Wiggins. Wish he broke that tackle. But he didn't. But it's a first down. And we're to the point where we could kind of run clock a little bit. I might want one more first down. Then we can kind of run clock make it the final. Oh, my goodness. This one defensive lineman has been killer. A little bit annoying. Robinson, got to take off again. Oh, could not get away. Only gained a yard. And now we got third down. I'm going to come out here. Oh, uh, do I like it? I do, actually. I think I like Wiggins here. On the end. Oh, Hulk, actually. Oh. <laughs> the diving swat down from, like, a foot away. Also, I'm surprised I could not get that off to uh, Javier Hulk. I'm a little bit frustrated. Let's see. This should be a decent punt. Why was that the longest thing ever? That was a terrible punt, actually. Uh, usually, I'm great at punting, but uh, not there. It's a big third down here. If we can get the stop, it'd be massive. Oh, it's out of reach. Oh, I thought I had a pick. They're killing clock. They should be throwing. Oh, it should be running. Get the pick. CJ, catch the ball. That's a pick, and that's that's game. Or not game, but I mean, that that's a huge... Oh, that's killer. That is absolutely killer. Yep, got this. And they're going to score. Worst case scenario. Oh, can't have that. Oh, I thought I might have saw a scene, but nope. 25 seconds left. I do kind of want to be a little bit aggressive here. Just to see, like, what, what are they going to show? Yep, make the catch out of bounds. Only three seconds. We gain 14 yards. What are we doing? Booth review? I mean, clearly a catch. This one might be a Wiggins? Not quite sure. Let's see. Nope, we're taking off. Go, Joseph. Oh, go, Joseph. Don't fumble. Timeout. Two timeouts remaining. We have more than enough time. We got more than enough time. I do feel like sometimes we play better when we have to, like, hustle. Like, when we think we have time, I feel like we don't do that well. Oh, my goodness. That's kind of a crazy throw. It was a crazy throw. Ooh, I got really nervous. Thought I threw a pick there. Thought it was going to be game over, but ended up not being game over. Yep, make that catch, bro. I'm going to call timeout just in case. No, I'm going to do something crazy here. I'm going to do a quarterback sneak to the right side only to try to get a better field goal kicker range. There you go. I didn't mean that. Like, get more central. There you go. Centralized in the field goal. It really didn't work out <laughs> very well. I thought I'd be able to angle him a little bit more. All right, this is a very good win. So, let's see. I don't think any more than that would be too much. He should make it. And we do. He's not the greatest kicker. But he's all right. Oh, I feel so much better. Got that field goal. Able to score. And now... I believe we get the ball to start. No, we started with it. Big third down. Oh, we're gonna shuffle over. Okay, we got everyone covered up. Always running up the middle. We are there. Shut him down. Give us that ball back. Finally got a good run there. Got about 10 from Salam. Can we get another one here? No, man, oh man. We lose two. He has had, what, three carries that have gone for more than a yard? It's, it's low-key kind of annoying. See, this man-to-man, -man, I might have Acevedo here. Acevedo, go get it. 
Acevedo, go get it. What a play by number 10. Knocking it away. Underthrown. If I'm being honest, the ball should have been had a little more air under it. Or at least like uh, out in front, I should say. Now, Javier Hulk. Again, this one's also underthrown. He's got to turn around to make that catch. And we got a punt. Well, 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 it's third down again. What can we do? Oh, it's our RPO. And they are about to score. Not fast enough. Not fast enough. And it's a three-point game. We got to be better than last last uh, series because that was atrocious. We went backwards four yards pretty much, it felt like. Wiggins wide open. Nobody on him. He's going to get a huge gain here. Across the 50 gets flipped over. And if we can play it safe here, we can score a touchdown here. This would be massive with the capital M. Great. Ironically, that's one of our best carries of the game by Salam. His second best. I see like a double reverse there. I'm not going to do it because I'm way too scared. <laughs> I am way too scared. But I do. I, man, I want to get the run game going. There's just no space. Final, maybe final play of the uh, third quarter. I want to go Wiggins here. Just go up and get it. Big oh. Moss is number 31. Literally picked it up over his head. First down, keeps the drive alive. Now we go to the fourth quarter. We're looking decent. I am very nervous, if I'm being honest. I don't feel the most confident. They're clogging up lanes and adjusting at like just the right time. Let's see. I'm still fine with killing clock here. Um, because I wanted to make like, there you go, Hulk. Hulk won this, is that his first catch today? No, he has another catch. He had one on, on the sideline earlier. I mean, this is uh, exactly what we want to do. Grind down the clock. Get a great drive here. Salam is... Uh, how, how did he get him pulled that way? I don't, I don't understand. Let's run again. Let's keep killing clock. They are stacking the middle of the line. Bounce it outside. I told him to juke. Didn't do anything. But here we are, third and six. I mean, a first down, we can kill a lot of clock here. Oh, bad throw. No, actually, it was Loki a dot. I mean, it hit his hands. Uh, just can't hang on. It's a difficult catch. Now, let's see. We don't want to miss this. Did I push it enough? I did. Perfect. Let's go. All right, we're up by six. I'm a little bit scared. We make one stop, and I think this game's over. I wouldn't mind another interception, you know? I ask, and we receive. Now, there is a flag. I don't know who it's on. I believe it is on Middle Tennessee. It is. It's a holding penalty. We're going to decline that. Stovall with his second interception. We have the ball. They have all their timeouts, so technically they can get the ball back. We don't. Actually, hold on. I'm going to play action here. Relax, relax, relax. I just feel like someone's going to get open here. Let it be Hulk. Oh, it's underthrown again. Moss him. Oh, that's so frustrating. I should have just ran the ball. That's my fault. Got greedy. Got greedy. I need to make them use their timeouts. Oh, look at this. I don't know what happened. Our best carry of the day is a first down. Kills one of their timeouts. And Slum is hurting out there. And I'm not saying it's game because technically they can get the ball back. But it, it does make it hard for them. Only got one yard there. But it's okay. It's all about eating clock. Are we in field goal range? I, I think the answer is no. Uh, it's, it's, tough to tell. it's tough to tell. I mean, it's like a 40-something yard field goal from here. Uh, I don't know. I don't know, fellas. I'm going to try to get a good carry. Come on. Give me something. Get, get their salam. Get their salam. That's the first time in war. And that... Is game over? Oh, we can kill clock. I know we could kneel it out. I'm gonna risk it just for stats. So I want to get better stats for Salam. Should I just kneel it out? 
And because of all of his wear and tear, yes. Need it out. Game over. Dragons win. Stats for the day. Uh, Robinson, only 17 attempts, uh, 9 completions. Not a great uh, percentage. Uh, 174, no touchdowns, no picks though. Uh, running the ball. He had their touchdowns on the ground. Okay. 8 for 52, 64 yards for Salam. A lot of it came on that like final drive, for being honest. Uh, receiving the ball again. Wiggins, 3 for 70. 2 for 27, and then one catch apiece for four different receivers. Defensively, uh, only had one, or one, two, three, why is there, how is there two and a half sacks? Doesn't make sense. But a lot of split sacks, but interceptions. Sidney Stovall, two picks, also had an intercept, or uh, a pick six. And then Hunter Haynes, able to come through. Defense won us this game. All right, let's advance. Let's see what we get in terms of recruiting. Come on, give us something. Give us something good. Jose Estes commits. Oh, Joey Blacklock commits. Miguel Romero commits. Eric Rafe. So many commits this week. One, two, three, four commits. All three stars. All very important to our team. Frees up a lot of um, hours as well. Steven Sidney Stolvo, no surprise. Defensive player of the week. Uh, two picks. One was an interception for a touchdown. I mean, defense really, really, really uh, gave us the win there. And we finish up with Western Kentucky. Kind of dig. Well, look at all of the names. Got to move these guys up. I like being able to scroll down and say, oh, hey, look at this. We have uh, lots of comments. And we have two more, right? Oh, they must have been on, on the mother. So how many do we have so far? A couple corners. So we have nine. Um, but we're, we're leading in a lot of these other guys as well. Uh, Patino's about to commit. Uh, Blair's close. Chancey's going to commit next week. Um, McGill we can put more into. Let me... Let me add some points to these guys. Okay, we did some things. Also fully scouted uh, Pudlesny. Oh, what a name. Uh, I mean, 6'3", deep threat, good speed as well. Uh, we really, really want him. Um, we have leads on a lot of these guys. Sands is also a gem, so he's more like a four-star. You guys, we are looking really good. And up next, what are we ranked? We were 17, and then we're up to number 15. That is interesting. So we go to the college football bracket. Uh, we are not in there. Um, I don't think Central USA gets an automatic bid. I'm pretty sure it doesn't. That'd be kind of wild if it did. Um, but let me take a look at the conference standings. Where are we in all of this? Oh my goodness, I gotta go find it. Uh, here we go. So we're 6-1. and one. We did not play Liberty. Uh, we lost to, to FIU. They lost to somebody. I'm not sure because they were 9-8-1. and or eight and one. Interesting. Okay. Well, I love that. I mean, look at this. We have the number one offense and the number one defense. Uh, explain, explain it to me. We, we uh, at least in the the, the division. Well, hey, Kentucky's coming up next. I'm Jelani. Thank you for liking, commenting, and subscribing, and we will see you next time.